definition of a haul? Is it like three items? Is it five items? Do you have to buy 10 items? Like when is your purchase considered a haul? Hello fearless folks, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Dr. Martin and you are watching Fearlessly Living. On this channel, we talk about medicine, lifestyle, and fashion. Today, however, we will be focusing on fashion. So, I purchased some things from Boohoo and I was thinking about it earlier and I was like, this is the package. I'm like, is this a haul or is this a grab? Because like, what's the definition of a haul? Is it like three items? Is it five items? Do you have to buy 10 items? Like when is your purchase considered a haul? When I think about a haul, I think about like, you have to put a lot of energy into carry something. When I think about a grab, you're like, you know, you can just kind of grab a few things. So I don't know, like where do we start? Cause Cause is it like you know two's a couple and three's a few so it's like three a grab and five a haul i don't know but i think i got a haul because i got more than five items at least so let's get into this boohoo haul y'all they are on sale they were at least when i purchased this and when i'm filming this video i think 40 percent off everything i would tell you how much i paid for each item how much the discount was and shipping and all of that good stuff so i'm going to open it up i have not opened up this package i am so excited because i can't wait to see what everything looks like so you're going to get my first impression of like everything i'm about to unbox so let's unbox it let's see what's inside this is what i'm wearing today is morphe i'm thinking like is it too much but i don't know i was going for a look morphe mega matte super matte goosebumps this is the color goosebumps it's on like the base brown and then um the gloss on top of it is also from the coffee shop collection from juvia's place this is mochaccino all right enough is enough let's open it i'm so excited there is a box there's a box okay so that gotta be another package because I definitely ordered a jacket that I don't automatically see in here. So that has to be another package. Has to be another package. Has to be another package. Because these are not all my items. Okay y'all, uh, from the top of my head already, I, I can tell I'm missing at least two things. But, um, so I go to the website and I think they sent three separate packages. So I guess maybe that's in there. Anyway, I'm just gonna go through what I have here because I'm already prepared for this video. Let's talk about the items I do have. <laughs> One of them is this. It's a cropped full letter biker jacket. It's in a size eight, which I would assume is a medium. Um, I'm not going to take the tags off just yet because I need to make sure it actually fits. There was a picture that really made me buy it. I'm going to superimpose the picture here too because I bought like this whole outfit. I bought the jacket and the skirt. So this is the jacket. This is the crop full leather, full leather biker jacket in a size 8 which I want to say is a medium. I got this for $33.55. I think it was originally for $63 or $64. To go with that, I got this skirt. It's a denim skirt. It literally has a split both sides. Like, it looks like pants. That black skirt is the, is the slick denim front and back skirt. I got that in a size 10. The original price is about $40. I got it for $23. To go with the outfit, I thought about boots because the girl in the outfit is wearing, the girl in the photo is wearing boots. They are like little cowboy boots, but this is what sold me. This is what sold me, this little thing right here. Cowboy boots. I just see myself wearing it, even with like jeans, but you just can see this little part. That's what sold me. Otherwise, they're a basic pair of shoes. They come up to the knee a little bit, so it could work. It could work. This is the knee-high pull-on western cowboy boots. Um, this is a size 8 that I got. 
it retailed for $84. I got it for $48 with the sale. So it's about this big. This is a tweed jacket or a tweed like jacket. Um I have really been into like tweed type materials and stuff lately, and I saw this jacket. I thought it was beautiful on the website, and I wanted to try it out to see what it would look like on me. I don't know, it's not giving like expensive, but I think. I think I could put it together and make it look expensive though. Like it's not really giving like that rich girl vibe right now, but and it's, it's definitely not sweet. I mean, come on. It's so thin. It's not very heavy, but it's not bad either. Jacket detail brooch jacket. Retail for $31. I got it for $28. So I have been into blazers for such a long time. Like I'm never going to get over blazers. And I think blazers are something I never go out of style. And you can dress it up, dress it down so many different ways. Um, I don't have one in this color. It's definitely a little darker. Yeah, now you can see it's kind of dark. So I don't have one in this color. So I thought to get one, I got it oversized. It's double breasted, the buttons match the co the color on the blazer. I definitely think I could do a lot with this blazer, so I'm excited to see what I come up with. This is the double breasted relaxed fit tailored blazer in a size eight. Retail for $61.33, I got it for $31. $61.33 is a little steep, don't they like? It feels good, it has shoulder pads, I just feel like more shoulder pads might be needed. I'm gonna start buying shoulder pads from the thrift store. So I just feel like I need to be up. <laughs> the last item in this package is this piece right here. I think this might be the pants. Color is, ooh, this color is beautiful. It's a beautiful color. Um, The pants are oversized, like I said. Ooh, I got them in a US 12. I should probably should've done like a 10 or something. But I got them in a US 12. I know for a fact they're gonna be big on me. Oh yeah, they're gonna be big. Y leg. It was supposed to come with a crop blazer, so then it's supposed to be like a suit together, relaxed fit, maybe like a white t-shirt underneath for like sneakers. That's kind of the thought I was going with with this. Um, I will have to redo this look and maybe do it in a different video. Maybe I'll just do like a video of like outfits or looks that I put together, but I don't have the top to this because that's something that didn't come in my package. I did try on is the maxi skirt or like this double slit skirt. Okay, <laughs> I'm obsessed with this skirt. No matter what I put on with this skirt, it eats. Like this skirt can be high heels, you know, sling backs, toes out, flats, boots um sneakers like what this skirt can do whatever you want it to do i feel like i gotta create a video just on the multiple ways to style this skirt like this skirt is it i love this skirt and really it's just like a mini skirt with like two two long flaps because the slit is pretty darn high but it's super comfortable i got it a little bit bigger um i feel like oversized items might also be like my new thing now too because like I kind of like how it felt. Like, it's not so severely oversized, like, super big, but, like, it's definitely a little bigger than my usual boots. So I usually like, like, nice fitting clothing that kind of hugs my body. But this is a nice little, like, change. I really love that about, like, this skirt. So I love this skirt. I would definitely recommend this skirt. Everything in this video will be linked below for you to shop and try out for yourself. Hopefully, the sale is still going on. If I have any promo codes, I will definitely add that to the bottom. Next, let's talk about this jacket. Like... I like it, I don't love it. I was thinking like should I have gotten a little bit smaller, but I think the oversize is better because I can wear with like turtlenecks and sweaters and my arms will still be able to move freely. Like this jacket I got on right now, I feel restricted because it's, it's well, it's like, it fits pretty snug. Um, that one is, is a lot more loose, which I like because it's versatile and I can wear with many different looks, many different outfits without a shirt, with a shirt, with a sweater, I can layer it. So I like that about it. It has a good look. I think I have to get used to it. It does look really good with the skirt though. Like that whole look looks good together. Um, and I think the whole thing comes together really well, especially with the boots and everything. So the boots, the skirt, the jacket, everything 10 on 10 will recommend. Like these boots though, these boots, y'all, yeah, they are so comfortable. I'm wearing them right now. <laughs> I never took it off. I'm even wearing a skirt still. Um, 
the boots are so comfortable i feel like i can literally like run errands and that's all day like you know how you want to go out and about maybe to the mall you want to go do a shopping day you want to look cute you want to create content whatever you want to do these boots are so nice because they're extremely comfortable but they're so stylish and they're stylish primarily because of that gold detailing on the front if it didn't have that gold detail on the front, it would be just basic behind boots, to be honest. That's the only reason I got them. But they're real cute, though. So I definitely recommend them. My front stop combination is rare. And when you find it, it's a keeper. So this is definitely a keeper. I love these boots already. Um, Next, though, so we went ahead and took the little full leather jacket off. And we put on this burgundy blazer, baby. This is an oversized blazer. It feels good it looks good i love it i don't really see myself buttoning it up i like that kind of like i was like is this like Balenciaga? like i liked how it was like kind of like hanging off my body and i could like put the blazer in like my palm like this i love that um i like the fit i like this I, like i said anything you put on with this skirt eats you can wear this skirt with anything and it's gonna eat. I'm already thinking about putting this skirt on with some sneakers, some bulky little socks I'm gonna steal from my husband's drawer. Um, put it on with like a crop hoodie and maybe like a even that jacket over it and just you change the look already. We even want a cap, you can put a hat on. And I'm ready to like style this skirt in so many different ways. Like I might create a whole new view on just how to style this skirt. I love this skirt. No matter what you wear with this skirt, it's gonna eat. Let's talk about this um tweed-ish jacket okay this tweed -ish jacket when you think about a tweed jacket you think about like style you think about chanel you think about high fashion this tweed jacket with this skirt mix it you can make it urban by leaving it open um with the very same look the skirt the boots everything or you could dress it up with like high heels or like sling backs your toes out whatever um but i feel like if you when you leave the jacket the jacket open it gives it more of an urban look or you can uh, even button it all the way up but just with the skirt gives it more of an urban look because usually with that it's very like you know half fashion tea parties you know croissants that's the kind of vibe i get with that tweed jacket so um don't love the tweed jacket but i like it with this look i like it with this skirt like i said anything you wear with this skirt is gonna eat regardless okay the baggy pants sorry i forgot to mention these pants i like these pants i might get them taken in a little bit just so it fits my hips a little bit but i like that it like drapes it like is saggy and it sits right above like the the um <laughs> the, the line of like the crack and like really rise really low because it's a size 12 um but i might get it fitted so it fits me a little bit but i like i got it bigger because i wanted it to have more like I want it to be very baggy like i want that dressy baggy look with the crop and like imagine myself with a newspaper a t-shirt under the crop jacket sneakers some shades just like running an errand like that's the look i was going for i don't have the crop jacket though i don't know where it is and i'm missing a winter coat that looks like this so um boo boo where's my stuff boo boo um, but the items I do I did get I do really like if I get the other stuff before I edit this video and post it I might just add it to the end if I don't it's gonna be a whole new video maybe styling or something when I bring it back into play but thank you so much for coming back to my channel it was so good to see you all I cannot say how much I appreciate your support I have had a flood of new followers like Thank you so much. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the fearless force. Okay. And we are all fearless folks. And this channel is about medicine, fashion, lifestyle. So that's what we're going to talk about. I might come in here and give you a little lecture about something that you should maybe get your cholesterol checked or maybe check your blood pressure every now and then and stop eating all these greasy food. I may come on here and say that, but most of the time I'm probably going to talk to you about fashion. Okay. And lifestyle thank you so much for coming to my channel my name once again is dr martin you have been watching fearlessly living with dr martin i will see you in the next video bye